When you're painting outside, anything can happen. I was in a park in Montreal one time and it seemed like everything that could go wrong did go wrong. Hi, James Gurney in Phillips Square in Montreal. I want to do a painting here in Cassine. It's a pretty peaceful place, but in a little while there's going to be a big festival for Caribbean people, so we'll see what happens. It's raining. Look at those clouds. Oh man, we don't have any kind of covering. Gotta get out under this tree. Should be okay for a while under this tree. Okay. Worse than the rain is the wind. Whoa, thing's blowing over. But eventually it settles down so that I can get back to work. The best defense against wind is to hang something heavy from the tripod and it won't blow over. The good thing about this weather is that it's an overcast day and that means the light won't change that much. I can focus on this octagonal building and also the base of the monument that's in the foreground. Half the challenge with a architectural subject like this is just keeping your line straight. And that just takes concentration and a steady hand. What is that? I didn't realize this when I started, but Square Phillips is the destination for the Cara Fiesta, the big Caribbean carnival and parade with people dressed up in elaborate devil costumes and feathered outfits, dancing, music, flatbed trucks, DJs, craziness. I wish I could paint this, but it would take a whole different palette of colors and a whole different approach. So I zero back in on my painting. This is the Hudson Bay company, the store across the street, and it's time to wrap it up and head back to the hotel and get a bite to eat. Tomorrow, another painting. Hi, if you enjoyed this video, you'll enjoy the full-length video, which takes you through the whole process from start to finish. It's all part of Casein Painting in the Wild. This includes seven different episodes in all kinds of different environments indoors in a wooden boat building shop, on a street in Colorado, a mountain stream, a landscape along a stream, a horse ranch in Wyoming. So come with me for casein painting in the wild. Uh, because of its fast drying and its opaque uh, handling properties. What I wanted... Oh man, she was biting the microphone. That's going to be a killer.